Today I'm showing you two best builds for the Devastator. Now I watched a lot of endgame gameplay from the devs and all their characters had 20 class points. So I'm going off a 20 class point build. Now the Devastator has increased armor and receives additional health. By far the ultimate ability out of the three classes. The Mighty Tank seems the best. And Unbroken Vow is just so beast. But let me get into the build real quick for those of you that just want to see the build. And it is increase max health, increase armor, increase max health, regen health, increase max health, more armor, increase max health, increase max health, resistance, armor. Gain additional health for every enemy at close range, more armor, and then increase your firepower and your anomaly power by armor. I think this one is just undisputed. That one has to be in it. That's 14. So now the two builds are going to split off at this point. You've used 14 points. So if you are one of those players that just wants to use shotguns, like you're a huge fan of the shotgun, you get 50% extra damage on the shotgun by using these four points right here that's going to give you 50 percent extra damage on your shotguns so now you're at 18 and you pick two of these three right here this combo right here is really beast for solo players this really only benefits you if you're playing with a team 20 percent extra that's only 20 percent on top of 24 percent so you're really only coming out at like 27, 28 uh, percent. Well, actually, 29 percent you come out at, and you don't have shield. So this is more of a multiplayer. So you would take these two if you're playing solo, and one of these two, and this one if you're playing on a team. The alternative build is if you're not a huge fan of the shotguns and you're going to be using more of a variety of weapons, then you will be taking right here the health regen once again the health regen you'll be taking kinetic you'll be taking weapon damage by 10 percent for each unlocked uh anomaly now this will give you 30 percent extra we weapons damage sorry for all weapons so that includes your shotguns all weapons 30 percent extra weapon damage regardless if you're in close range or long range so that actually is pretty beast. And your last two, once again, you will be selecting from these three right here. <laughs> Same principle, whether you're playing solo or whether you're playing in a group. And those two builds should definitely hold up as two of the top builds for the Devastator for the game. You might want to tweak a little bit depending if they add more class points late game. But for the moment with 20 class points being the basis which it looks to be, these are two of the best builds for the Devastator. I hope that helps.